Oh, hey. Mix this with tequila, and I got on my new socks. These pills right here, host defense mushrooms, lion's mane, memory and nerve support, gluten-free dietary supplement, 120 vegetarian capsules. Oh good, they didn't put meat in it. Is that a good look? They smell like fucking dog treats. Directions for use as a dietary supplement. Take two capsules once per day. It can be taken with food or without on an empty stomach or as recommended by your healthcare advisor. Also, these statements have not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. The product is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. Other ingredients, dried mislatated brown rice. And pululululin, I have no idea what those things mean, or what any of it is. Lion's mane mushroom, 550 milligram polysaccharides. Serving size, two per capsule. Servings per container, 60. There's 120, I already said that. These things suck and don't do shit. I'm pretty sure it's all bullshit, and I don't know why I fell for it. I know why I fell for it. This guy, uh, Paul, where's his name? Ah, oh, it's not on here. Was it Paul Steitman? Paul Stateman? This guy is a mushroom fanatic. Uh, mushroom enthusiast. He thinks it's important. They use mushrooms to do different things. He wears a fucking mushroom hat. He was on Joe Rogan's podcast. And he was talking about how amazing this mushroom was. And how it helps to better grow and recognize patterns and stuff in the brain. And that in mice, giving them the lion's mane mushroom, that it, their brains recovered from, they had brain injuries or it was smaller, or some bullshit, whatever. And he also said that the mushrooms were able to grow a better subway system than Tokyo has, even though Tokyo has the most advanced subway system. Which, again, is bullshit. But I got drawn in by the allure of growing my brain and becoming smarter and all that other shit. I'm like, fuck yeah, man. I'm going to do it. And then I bought them. I think I spent like $50 on them, which is too much, at some sort of um, supplement vitamin shop. Which, when walking in there, you're like, this stuff is all completely fucking bullshit. And I remember there was a guy there. That, uh, it seems like a, um, 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 a stereotype. But a guy's like, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get buff. And I just want to uh, see these uh, supplements to help me uh, you know, like work out and stuff. And the other guy's like, yeah, totally. You're going to need this and this and this. And you're a sucker. And it's on your forehead. And you're going to want this. And yeah, working out totally, bro. That's what I do too, huh? Yeah, uh-huh. Mm, mm, fuck. Oh, my God. Anyways, but half those people that go in there to work out and that have the idea that I'm going to get a bunch of pills and supplements and I'm going to work out, they do it for like a day and then quit because it's just an idea. It's not really what they want to do. You got to start working out and then maybe buy some stuff. My point is zero out of 10. And the first time I took them, I thought maybe it was doing something, but I don't think it was. This is the second time me buying them, but this time I'm getting stomach pains. I've taken them. And then gone to work, and I'm like, why the fuck does my stomach hurt so much? Like, what are they doing? This must be a tainted batch. It's probably tainted, and I don't know why I'm eating this, because it's not doing a goddamn thing. But, also, both the times I took them, I feel like my dreams were more vivid, and I don't know why. Maybe it was helping recognize patterns. What do they mean? There was one with the expanding man. But anyways, and it's not doing anything. The fact that he said that it helps grow damaged mice brains back, maybe, but I'm not a fucking mouse. And I'm like 200 times bigger than a mouse, right? My brain's huge. Their brain's tiny and they're dumb and they're simple. Like for that to happen to me, uh, I'd have to eat this whole bottle every day probably. And then I would die. And I'm not going to do that. And the only reason I wasted my money on it the second time is because I had a gift card. And I used that money to buy this because I was spending it frivolously. And then the other statement, he said, the mushrooms grew a better uh, subway system than Tokyo has, bitch. You're leaving out so much more information, like it was growing on top of a thing and it branched out in the best pattern. Okay, I can understand that, but you have to take in uh, fucking, they're trying to make it a wow factor, but how's fucking Tokyo just supposed to be like, all right, just like, uh, they gotta dig tunnels and stuff. It's expensive, it's too, you can't compare it to that. It doesn't work, there's too much involved in building a city. There's already an active city on top. To build tunnels is a little more difficult than a mushroom just growing patterns on the top of a thing. I'm upset because I got drawn sucked into this bullshit because I was like, 
Yeah. I'm gonna be smarter. Ugh, I think the mushrooms are working. Ugh, I'm fucking... God damn it. Don't waste your money on supplements and stuff. That's my PSA. Okay, bye. And I used that money to buy this because I was spending it frivolously.